Here are five tips to improve work transparency with Slack. You can find more info and helpful links about each of these tips in the description. And if you're not yet using a paid Slack plan, you can save 50% on Slack Pro for three months by clicking the link here or below. Okay, here are five tips to increase transparency in your business. Tip number one, bring all of your communications into Slack. The fastest way to increase work transparency is to move all of your communications into one place. So instead of having emails, texts, group chats, phone calls, even live meetings, you can house it all in one place, Slack. This goes beyond just your immediate team. Invite your customers into a shared channel or bring in your partners or vendors into their own shared channel. This is powered by Slack Connect, and it's quick and easy to invite external teammates to collaborate with you in Slack. And if you have work going on in other places, such as a project management tool or a content storage tool, then you can bring this into Slack as well with more than 2,600 out-of-the-box integrations that connect seamlessly in Slack. Having the right people, Information and tools in one place in Slack means your teams can quickly understand what everyone is working on, a key part of increasing transparency. Tip number two, work in public channels. Having most of your work happen in public channels will quickly increase work transparency across your business. Create specific channels for each project so your team knows what's happening with your new company design, or how the latest marketing campaign is performing, whatever you may be working on. Attach all the relevant items for each project in a ch channel inside the channel canvas. With this canvas right in the channel, you can include all the key information for the project so everyone knows right where to find everything they need. Did you know that at Slack, most of our channels are public channels. It enables transparency across our large team and accounts for people working in many different time zones around the world. Public channels are a core part of improving work transparency in your business. Tip number three, use direct messages for one-on-ones. While public channels are great, sometimes you need a private discussion. This is where direct messages or DMs come in. To go deeper on DMs, check out this how-to video here. We suggest using DMs when you need to have a nuanced private discussion with another person without needing to notify everyone else on a project or team. Pro tip, if you've ever finalized a decision in a DM, make sure you share out the relevant updates and outcomes in the right public channel. So ask yourself, are there any outcomes or updates from this DM that should be shared out? Important items can sometimes get stuck in DMs, so building a habit of sharing publicly will continue to improve your work transparency. Tip number four, use private channels for focus discussions. Public channels and direct messages are great but what if you need to chat with a specific team or group about sensitive items? Create a private channel and invite the right people. Check out this how-to video to learn more. You can create private channels for teams, product features, or by goals, whatever you may need. For me, only about 10% of my conversations are in a private channel. At Slack, we try to create a transparent culture by using public, and private channels for the right things, and that helps us to do that. Private channels round out the most common needs from your team of working publicly, connecting in one-on-ones, and sharing in private teams. Tip number five, experiment and improve. So you've implemented these ideas, now what? First, congrats on taking major steps toward bettering your organization. Second, now is the moment 
to experiment and to make things even better. Here's how. Offer a variety of options for people to raise issues. Some team members like to write their thoughts, while others prefer discussions in live meetings. By offering a consistent, reliable mix of public venues for transparent discussion that includes virtual and live options, you'll meet everyone's needs. Ask for feedback through an automated workflow. Make sure you're getting the feedback on what's working and what's not by collecting it via the workflow builder. It's a simple way to collect feedback across your business. There's even an out of the box template for you to add to a channel to allow your teammates to ask questions and share feedback. Next, try new app integrations. Slack integrates with more than 2,600 apps and services. So try something new, bring all that work to one spot. Maybe Notion or an Asana integration to bring your project management tools into Slack. Or how about Google Drive integrations to easily share your company spreadsheets across your team? These integrations can help increase visibility into your business while also demonstrating your commitment to maintaining an open, ongoing dialogue with employees. You've built a strong foundation of work. Transparency with the first four tips. Now, experiment and improve to make your business best in class. That's it. Five tips on how to improve work transparency with Slack. Check out the description box to find more on each tip. And if you're not yet on a paid Slack plan, save 50% on Slack Pro for three months, be sure to check out the description box for the link. See you next time, friends.